Okay. So we have opened up Nidam uh, from our app here. It's running and we have the Wi-Fi switched off and we are now going to check out the options. So we have max uh, 5000 tokens and we can load any of these uh, AI models that you can just click to download from Hugging Face and uh, it'll be uh, set up for you to use or you can side load any of your own uh, favorite LLMs or you can uh, load something that you created yourself. Uh, for free, for the uh, speech to text part, we are using Whisper Base and for the text to speech part, we are using uh, Nidam's own Samantha. Right. So we are using a uncensored version of Llama and it's offline as you can see. And I'm going to click on the advanced voice mode. Hi, I'm Samantha, your AI assistant powered by Netum AI. How can I help you today? Hi, Samantha. Uh, can you tell me what is the capital city of uh, United States of America? The capital city of the United States of America is Washington, D.C. Uh, Samantha, can you name five countries starting with the letter L? One, Luxembourg. Two, Latvia. Three, Lebanon. Four, Lesotho. Five, Liberia. Samantha, can you uh, explain uh, quantum computing to me like I am a 10-year-old? Imagine that you have a super powerful computer that can do lots of things really fast, like play games or solve puzzles. But what if this computer could do even more things, like predict the future or understand really complicated things? That's kind of what quantum computing is. It's a special kind of computer that can do lots of things really fast and understand really complicated things. But how does it work? Well, imagine that you have a toy box where you store all your toys, and every time you play with your friends, you take out a different toy and do something fun with it. Quantum computers are like that toy box. They have special things called qubits, quantum bits that can do lots of things at the same time, like play a game or solve a puzzle. And because they can do so many things at the same time, they can solve problems that are really hard or take a long time to solve on a regular computer. So quantum computing is like a super powerful magic toy box that can do lots of things really fast and understand really complicated things. And the best part is, it keeps getting better and better, like a puzzle that's always getting harder to solve. Uh, excellent. Thank you. Bye. You're welcome. It was a pleasure chatting with you. Goodbye for now. So, uh, all the uh, dialogues that we had are also uh, showing up here because it was transcribed. You can edit any of these, copy them, uh, paste them elsewhere. So whatever GPT-4.0 uh, and the advanced voice mode and all these guys are offering, uh, we have it offline and it's completely free and it's completely private. So think of all of the things that you can wink wink uh, do uh, on your machine completely offline and it's now ready for uh, Mac and Windows. We're going to have the Linux version out soon as well. Uh, meanwhile, let me try something. Hi, I'm Samantha, your AI assistant powered by Netum AI. How can I help you today? Uh, hi, so I'd like you to uh, help me become motivated uh, to exercise. I, I see that I'm uh, coming up with excuses and not exercising as much.
it's great that you're recognizing your excuses and wanting to make a change. Let's work together to find ways to increase your motivation to exercise. First, let's identify the reasons why you're not exercising as much as you'd like. Is it because you're too busy or is there another factor at play? Once we understand the root cause, we can come up with strategies to overcome it. Gotcha. So I am not exercising as much because I am way too comfortable uh, on my couch and I absolutely love uh, unhealthy snacks. It sounds like you're enjoying the comfort of your couch and the taste of unhealthy snacks, which is making it difficult for you to find the motivation to exercise. Let's try to find a balance between your love for comfort and your desire to be healthy. First, let's talk about the snacks. While it's okay to enjoy the occasional unhealthy treat, it's important to maintain a balanced diet. Perhaps we can come up with healthier snack options that you enjoy so you can still satisfy your cravings without compromising your health. Second, let's address the issue of comfort. It's important to find a balance between being comfortable and being active. Perhaps we can suggest some light exercises that you can do while sitting on your couch, like oh, stretching. Okay, stop. Uh, meanwhile, can you uh, tell me a rallying uh, phrase that you know will get me so motivated that I'll start uh, working out now? Get moving, feel the burn, and conquer the day. All right, that was great. <laughs> Thank you, Samantha. Have a great day. Bye. You're welcome. And that uh, was our advanced uh, voice mode that uh, we just saw, completely offline and private. And all the conversations are transcribed here. Uh, for later use. Now, the model that we were talking with is just a really regular Llama 3.23 billion uh, uncensored model that we created. Uh, so we fine-tuned it, but it's still very general. What you can do is you can create uh, or use one of the uh, really good models from Hugging Face that is uh, specialized to uh, role play for either for games or for salacious things or uh, to teach you uh, advanced uh, math or physics or whatever you want to learn uh, you know so you can do so many things and uh, the whole conversation is going to be private and sitting on your computer alone and no centralized company will ever uh, get a peek at your conversations with your own AI uh, running on your computer so uh, this is where the world is going towards i believe uh, every consumer uh, hardware uh, is becoming all the more powerful so yeah uh, there's no reason why we should not all have advanced voice mode uh, for ourselves offline 